Cal kicked off the 2004 season before a national ESPN audience at Air Force. And it's the season opener for the 14th ranked California Golden Bears. And California, Kelly, has not been ranked this high in half a century, and the expectations are soaring for a special year. The Bears racked up 56 points in the round, showing that its preseason number 13 ranking was no fluke. Bursting up the middle, wide open, touchdown, and that's the second touchdown of the day for Arrington. The Bear defense grounded the Air Force triple option, shutting out the Falcons for the final three quarters in Cal's 56-14 win. A Cal opening day record crowd of 60,000 greeted the Bears for the home opener against New Mexico State. Aaron Rodgers threw for 266 yards and two scores, while J.J. Arrington added another three touchdown day on 177 yards rushing as the Bears rolled to the win. J-Town, they won't catch him. Touchdown Bears! Entrenched in the nation's top 10, Cal kicked off Pac-10 play on national TV at Oregon State. The Bears dominated from the start as Pac-10 Player of the Week Chase Lyman scored three first quarter touchdowns on a career high 176 yards. The Cal defense held the Beavers to a single score and the 49-7 route set the stage for a showdown with number one ranked USC. The number seven ranked Bears rolled into Los Angeles for a showdown with USC. ESPN Game Day and ABC TV were on hand to cover the Pac-10 Game of the Year. The Golden Bear defense came of age on a national stage, holding the vaunted Trojan running game to just 41 yards. The Trojan offense sputtered all day as Southern Cal was held to just 205 yards, 12 first downs, and the lowest point total of the year. Bushes in the backfield, Liner's gonna throw, he's gonna get sacked! Oh my, what a sack, and maybe the sack of the year for the Bears before this game is over. On the day, Aaron Rodgers set an NCAA record with 23 straight completions, and was named Pac-10 Player of the Week. And J.J. Arrington rolled for 112 yards rushing, the first 100-yard performance surrendered by USC since Cal did it last year. In a college classic, Cal drove deep into Trojan territory in the waning moments, looking for the winning score. First and goal at the nine. But on the final fourth down play, Jonathan McConan slips on the route, and the Trojans dodge a bullet to escape with the win. Despite the setback, the nation's football experts knew the real story from L.A. And ladies and gentlemen, the best football team did not win this game. Cal is a better football team in almost every aspect of the game than Southern California. But I tell you what, Kirk, I have never seen a quarterback like Aaron Rodgers play a game like that in a hostile environment like that. That was unbelievable. Yeah, well, I think that's true, guys. I don't see any reason for Cal to fall in the rankings just because you lose a tight game at USC. No, if anything, I moved Cal up. I mean, other than some mistakes, they, they held USC's offense to 205 yards of total offense. Well, Cal fans thinking Rose Bowl. Yeah, that's, that's what I think. That's, that's right. They look Both those teams for the NBC. They just look like two BCS worthy teams here today. The next week, the number eight Bears were back home for another nationally televised game versus UCLA. Tonight from Berkeley, California, college football on TBS. Part of Big PlayStation Saturday kicks off now. And it is the largest crowd of the year. Over 65,000 have come to Berkeley, California. As number eight Cal hosts the four and one Bruins from UCLA. Aaron Rodgers tossed a career-high four touchdown passes, and the Bears racked up 550 yards in a 45-point thrashing of the Bruins. Three-step drop by Rodgers, steps back, throws for the end zone, has a receiver out there, caught! Touchdown, Bears! Touchdown for California! But the star of the day was J.J. Arrington, who had a career-best 205 yards and was named Pac-10 Player of the Week. Big win, though, for Jeff Tedford and the California Golden Bears.
down in the desert at Arizona, the Cal defense starred in a 38 to nothing shutout of the Wildcats. He drops back to throw. He's going to take a beating, and he does. Verchek. Volchek rolling to his left. Grabbed by Mebane and sacked as he tried to sweep around. The Volchek under pressure. Throws to the right sideline. Intercepted. Bears on a deflection. The game was over by halftime as Aaron Rodgers tossed three first half touchdowns and J.J. Arrington logged his sixth straight 100 yard rushing performance. The following week, number 20 ASU visited Memorial Stadium for a nighttime showdown. Freshman Robert Jordan opened the scoring with his first score as a Bear. Goes for the end zone. He's got an open man. It is caught. Touchdown Bears. Harrison, he's got it. It's a youngster, Robert Jordan. And J.J. Arrington rolled for 188 yards to break the 1,000-yard mark for the season. The Cal defense shut down and shut out the high-powered Sun Devil offense in front of a national TV audience. The Cal D forced five turnovers and even added a score. On the right sideline, Mixon, he's inside the 30, he's to the 20, cuts into the 10, he's to the 5, he's into the end zone, touchdown Bears! With the 29 to nothing win, Cal moved into the nation's top five. For the second consecutive game, Jeff Tedford's defense has stepped up to the challenge and Cal just dominated this game on the scoreboard. It is almost surely imagination, but the sound of the chimes from the Campanile Tower seem to have more energy, the tone may be even sweeter as it echoes across Strawberry Canyon. But then it might be the number four national ranking of the football team. The Oregon Ducks jumped out to an early lead, and the Bears needed a Rodgers to MacArthur two-minute drill to cut the halftime lead to just six points. In the second half, the Cal defense returned to form with 30 minutes of shutout football, giving the offense a shot at victory. Down the stretch, Aaron Rodgers produced the game-winning drive, once again finding MacArthur in the end zone. Rodgers straight back to throw, looks for somebody open, goes for the goal line, caught! Touchdown Bears, MacArthur! Post pattern, what a bonanza! The gritty one-point win kept the Bears in the thick of the BCS hunt.